Radia Joy Perlman born 1951, is an American computer programmer and network engineer. She is most famous for her invention of the Spanning Tree Protocol STP, which is fundamental to the operation of network bridges, while working for Digital Equipment Corporation. She also made large contributions to many other areas of network design and standardization, such as link state routing protocols. More recently she has invented the Trill Protocol to correct some of the shortcomings of spanning trees. She is currently employed by Dell EMC. Early life Perlman grew up near Asbury Park, New Jersey. Both of her parents worked as engineers for the U.S. government. Her father worked on radar and her mother was a mathematician by training who worked as a computer programmer. During her school years Perlman found math and science to be effortless and fascinating, but had no problem achieving top grades in other subjects as well. She enjoyed playing the piano and French horn. While her mother helped her with her math homework, they mainly talked about literature and music. Despite being the best science and math student in her school, it was only when Perlman took a programming class in high school that she started to consider a career that involved computers. She was the only woman in the class and later reflected, I was not a hands on type person. It never occurred to me to take anything apart. I assumed I'd either get electrocuted, or I'd break something. Education As an undergraduate at MIT Perlman learned programming for a physics class. She was given her first paid job in 1971 as part-time programmer for the Logo Lab at the then MIT Artificial Intelligence Laboratory, programming system software such as debuggers. Working under the supervision of Seymour Papert, she developed a child-friendly version of the educational robotics language Logo, called TORTIS. Toddler's own recursive turtle interpreter system. During research performed in 1974 to 76, young children, the youngest aged three and a half years, programmed a logo educational robot called a turtle. Perlman has been described as a pioneer of teaching young children computer programming. As a math grad at MIT, she needed to find an advisor for her thesis and joined the MIT group at BBN Technologies. There, she first got involved with designing network protocols. Perlman obtained a B.S. and M.S. in mathematics and a Ph.D. in computer science from MIT in 1988. Her doctoral thesis at MIT addressed the issue of routing in the presence of malicious network failures. When studying at MIT in the late 60s she was one among the 50 or so women students, in a class of about 1,000 students. To begin with MIT only had one women's dorm, limiting the number of women students that could study. When the men's dorms at MIT became co-ed Perlman moved out of the women's dorm into a mixed dorm, where she became the resident female. She later said that she was so used to the gender imbalance, that it became normal. Only when she saw other women students among a crowd of men she noticed that it kind of looked weird. Topic. Career She is most famous for her invention of the Spanning Tree Protocol STP, which is fundamental to the operation of network bridges, while working for Digital Equipment Corporation. Perlman is the author of a textbook on networking and co-author of another on network security. She holds more than 100 issued patents. She was a fellow at Sun Microsystems and has taught courses at the University of Washington, Harvard University and MIT, and has been the keynote speaker at events all over the world. Perlman is the recipient of awards such as Lifetime Achievement Awards from Usenix and the Association for Computing Machinery Special Interest Group on Data Communication SIGCOMM. Topic: <laughs> Spanning Tree Protocol. Perlman invented the Spanning Tree Algorithm and the Spanning Tree Protocol STP. While working as a consulting engineer at the Digital Equipment Corporation in 1984 she was tasked with developing a straightforward protocol which enabled network bridges to locate loops in a local area network LAN. It was required that the protocol should use a constant amount of memory when implemented on the network devices, regardless how large the network was. Building and expanding bridged networks was difficult because loops, where more than one path leads to the same destination, could result in the collapse of the network. 
Redundant paths in the network meant that a bridge could forward a frame in multiple directions. Therefore loops could cause Ethernet frames to not reach their destination, flooding the network. Perlman utilized the fact that bridges had unique 48-bit MAC addresses, and devised a network protocol so that bridges within the LAN communicated with one another. The algorithm implemented on all bridges in the network allowed the bridges to designate one root bridge in the network. Each bridge then mapped the network and determined the shortest path to the root bridge, deactivating other redundant paths. Despite Perlman's concerns that it took the spanning tree protocol about a minute to react when changes in the network topology occurred, in which time a loop could bring down the network, it was standardized as 802.1D by the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers Perlman said that the benefits of the protocol amount to the fact that, "...you don't have to worry about topology," when changing the way a LAN is interconnected. Perlman has however criticized that changes were made in the course of the standardization of the protocol, from the paper, "...an algorithm for distributed computation of a spanning tree in an extended LAN." 1. Algorithm A think that I shall never see a graph more lovely than a tree, a tree whose crucial property is loop-free connectivity, a tree which must be shorter span so packets can reach every LAN, first the route must be selected. By ID it is elected, least cost paths from root are traced. In the tree these paths are placed, a mesh is made by folks like me. Then bridges find a spanning tree. Other network protocols Perlman was the principal designer of the DCNet IV and V protocols, which are part of the DCNet network protocol suite for peer-to-peer -peer network architectures. She also made major contributions to the Connectionless Network Protocol (CLNP). Perlman has collaborated with Yakov Rector on developing network routing standards, such as the Open System Interconnection Routing Protocol (IDRP), which allows routers in packet switching networks to communicate with one another across broadcast domains. At DEC, she also oversaw the transition from distance vector to link state routing protocols. Link state routing protocols had the advantage that they adapted to changes in the network topology faster, and DEC's link state routing protocol was second only to the link state routing protocol of the Advanced Research Projects Agency Network ARPANET. While working on the DCNet project Perlman also helped to improve the Intermediate System to Intermediate System Routing Protocol, known as ISIS, so that it could route the Internet Protocol IP, Apple Talk and the Internetwork Packet Exchange IPX Protocol. The Open Shortest Path First OSPF Protocol relied in part on Perlman's research on fault-tolerant broadcasting of routing information. Perlman subsequently worked as network engineer for Sun Microsystems, now Oracle. She specialized on network and security protocols and while working for Oracle obtained more than 50 patents. <laughs> <laughs> Awards National Inventors Hall of Fame Induction 2016. Internet Hall of Fame Induction 2014. SIGCOMM Award 2010. USENIX Lifetime Achievement Award 2006 Recipient of the first Anita Borg Institute Women of Vision Award for Innovation in 2005 Silicon Valley Intellectual Property Law Association Inventor of the Year 2003 Honorary Doctorate Royal Institute of Technology June 28 2000 Twice named as one of the 20 most influential people in the industry by Data Communications magazine, in the 20th anniversary issue January 15, 1992, and the 25th anniversary issue January 15, 1997. Perlman is the only person to be named in both issues. Fellow of the Association for Computing Machinery, Class of 2016 Bibliography <inaudible> 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 Perlman, Radia 1999. Interconnections, Bridges, Routers, Switches, and Internetworking Protocols 2 ed. Addison Wesley Professional Computing Series. ISBN 978-0-201-63448-8. Perlman, Radia, Kaufman, Charlie, Spieschina, Mike 2002. Network Security, Private Communication in a Public World 2 ed. PTR Prentice Hall. ISBN 978-0-13-046019-6